hello everyone welcome to today's video today we are going to learn how to split the data in your day to day work life you may have to split data based on many parameters if it is a sales data then you may be asked to split the data based on the region based on the sales person based on the product group so on and so forth in today's video we are going to see and learn how to split the data based on any given parameter so without much delay let's jump into our sample data set and learn how to split the data here is a data set which has information basically on the credit card details you see various details like id first name last name email id gender credit card type credit card number So now what we are going to do is we are going to split the data based on the credit card type which is in column F. So what we are going to do now is we are going to create a pivot table out of this data. How do we do that? Select the entire table, go to insert pivot table option from table. I am going to take a new worksheet for now. Click okay. So here is a pivot table. So what I am going to do is since I need everything in the same format I am going to just order everything in rows section. So I have brought in all the information in the rows section. I will bring in credit card type into the filters because I want to split data based on the credit card type. On what basis on what filter criteria you want to filter your data? You have to bring that field into the filters pane. Now I have brought in credit card type into filters pane. let me do some modification to the pivot table so that it looks neat and clean right now it looks neat and the data that you see is exactly in the order that i wanted so once you do that click on the b1 cell where the filter is then go to pivot table analyze just select a drop down under pivot table and you see another option and another small drop down just next to that options button click that you see again three options so select the second option show report filter pages once you select that then the criteria appears here i have only one criteria so i'm just going to select credit card type click okay once you click okay magic happens so you can see now various tabs got created I'm American Express, Maestro, Mastercard, Visa and Visa Electron, right? So the data is split into different tabs based on the credit card type. Isn't that interesting? For more such Excel tips and tricks, please subscribe to my channel, share my videos and put your thoughts in the comment box. Until my next video, happy learning.